Hi everybody, Brad Nessler here with Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit bringing you today's exciting matchup. And it is perfect football weather here for today's matchup between the North Carolina State Wolfpack and the Tar Heels of North Carolina. Today we have a big in-state rivalry matchup. And let me tell you, these guys do not like each other. And here come the Tar Heels. The Tar Heels are not a bunch of kids, and rightfully so. This team is just too powerful. North Carolina has a big-time quarterback who can really put up some big numbers against this team. I look for him to have an outstanding game, spreading the ball to his receivers. Lee, look for a big one. You're absolutely right. North Carolina is going to do it. Thanks, Coach. The pregame routine just wouldn't be the same without that prediction. Now let's get the coins on. And they're ready to kick this one off. They'll be returning this one. Number 13 fields it in the end zone. <laughs> Down there on the field at linebacker, we've got one special player. He's the heart and soul of this defense, and they're going to need him today more than ever as they go up against a very talented running back. If there's anyone who can bring the woods to this running back, then it's got to be this linebacker. That's why he's a tough one. There should be some really good collisions in this game. The running back gives them six yards on the ground. North Carolina State is ranked near the bottom of the barrel as far as offense goes. Well, the numbers don't lie. They just can't move the ball. Number nine, back in the gun. This 
one out to the left. And it falls incomplete. He had his wide out, but he couldn't hit him. When he misses, it's usually high. That's something he's been working very hard with his coach. Third down and four coming up on this one. Long in the old 34. Come out showing three wide. Across the middle. Short pass on his tight end. Good reason. North Carolina State lining up the front. Number 26 gets it off. Number 25, they get the 23. We'll get a chance to see if this offense can fare any better than their counterparts. Right. They'll get the ball here at the 28-yard line. The Tar Heels line up with three wide. He's under some heat. Watch the throw outside. And he overthrew his wide receiver. I don't know if too many seven-foot guys play football, so maybe he should aim lower the next time. Second and ten, ball on the 28-yard line. The Tar Heel set up in the gun, steps up in the pocket, fires deep down the left side. Caught at the 30, to the 20, to the 10. Touchdown, North Carolina. They were looking for a big play, and they got one. Mr. All-American himself scores the touchdown. Wow, he makes you a piece of it. Plays like that, I want to shut that. And he taps on the extra point. Time to take a look at the Pontiac Drive Summer. And remember, the good folks at Pontiac has been bringing you fuel to the soul since 1926. Number 10 is lined up to kick this one off. He gets a booming kick. Number 13 fields it in the end zone. The offense gets ready to start a new drive. Going three and out. He'll take over at the point. Come out showing three wide. Play action. Over the middle. Incomplete. He had his wide out, but he couldn't hit him. When he misses, it's usually high. That's something he's been working very hard with his coach. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the point. The wolf pack. Line up with four wide out. Working the gun. They'll drop it for a loss. Loss of about six. It looks like this defense has put up some very impressive numbers this time. I'll tell you what, they're fast, they're strong, and they're talented. That reality should be one thing for the offenses. They need to play great football all year. This one is going to be a massive beat. It's first and ten. All in the third and one. North Carolina State lines up with three receivers. He juked him out of his shoe. Brought down. The running back picks up a yard on the counter. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on their own 32. One man backfield. They make the stop. Maybe a few. That's it. So another third down of Kelly for the offense. Come out of the ace formation. Drop back to pass. Complete to the true freshman. He hits his man, but they'll be well short of the first. That young man has to run the pattern to get beyond those steps. 
six, the next time. Bumps the ball away. Ball is loose. Fumble. Number 10 recovers a loose ball. I run the misdirection counter. They with the defense a loose. They'll set up shot at the 24. Counter play. And he's taken down. The halfback runs for four yards. You got to keep the defense honest by throwing in a good play action pass every now and then. Second and six coming up here. Ball on their own 28. Let's see if they look the wide out this way. He is in the zone. They'll make the sack. The Tar here. Line up with three wide. He dropped it back. Over the middle. Brought down. And the quarterback got hit, but what is it late? What's on the The defense left them a hand with that penalty. Guys, giving up penalty yards is so frustrating, isn't it? The key here is making sure the offensive line gives the quarterback plenty of time to find the open receiver. North Carolina comes to the line with three wide. Throws it to the outside. Got him on the run. They'll bring him down. Nice decision by the quarterback. Not only was it good decision making, but the offensive line protected just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, it'll be a first down nine out of ten times. This is where you just go with what you know the best. It's first and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. The Tar here. Line up in an eye formation. Gets the ball. No, they fake it. Rolls right. He's going right. Tackle. Nice little pinch and catch with a wide out. Quarterback and receiver spend a lot of time. The coaches say they stay after practice, just working on their timing right there at KO. When you can smell the end zone, you know you're right there. Now, smelling it and tasting it are two different things. You've got to be able to taste the end zone because it means six points. Back to pass. Across the middle. Someone got a hand up. Big play by the defense. North Carolina sets up in the eye. They're going to pitch it. And he's tackled at the eight. So he picked up a few on that run. Yeah, he did a nice job of using his blockers on that run. Really a nice read. When you're in the red zone, you're real close. That close is not good enough. You've got to come away with a touchdown right here. They're going to set back here. Now it's going to pitch it off. They'll bring him down. That's a nice six yard game. Here's what I do I get the ball in my backpack and let him run in for a score. They put everyone up on the line. A tackle. A little laundry on the field. And we'll find out whose it is. Oh, they are. Oh, they are. That's definitely a over back a bit. Yeah, and with so many young guys out there, it's bound to happen occasionally. When you're inside your opponent's 20, you can play it safe or you can go for it all. I let my quarterback throw for a touchdown here. Number 18 comes to the line with three wide. Enzo! Oh, boy, almost intercepted. They just couldn't capitalize on the bad pass. Yeah, I thought the defender had it, but he couldn't get the pick. On the 12, and they can smell the goal line. Number 18 with three wide receivers. Across the middle. And this will be caught. Touchdown! My goodness, guys, that was a spectacular play by the wide receiver. 
receiver. But the coach has gone to great lengths to shift those receivers. And we've seen the results on the field. This one's simple. Kick the PAT. And he hits the PAT. Time to take a look at the Pontiac Drive Summer. And remember, the good folks at Pontiac has been bringing you fuel for the soul since 1926. North Carolina, ready to kick this one off. Kicks it off. Number 13, feels it in the end zone. I don't know if you guys know. Both kids in off at quite a speed. Two help 
they get an easy drive. The question is, can they do it again? They line up in an eye. Setting up the play action. Watch the throw outside. I know it's incomplete, but still, you've got to be impressed with the zip that he put on that. He did have some heat on it. That's for sure. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 11 yard line. High formation here. He drops back. Throws it to the outside. Got it. And he's tackled. I like the defense that was told. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed and the result is the first down. I love a good draw play. You've got the defense making faster. Then you run the ball for a nice game. North Carolina comes to the line with three wide. <laughs> Tackle. The quarterback gets a couple on the draw play. In this situation, you got to trust the quarterback's decision making. It's second down, eight to go. Ball on the 30. The tar here. Line up with three wide. Drop back to pass. He's looking. Throws it out there. This will be a top 10. He comes down with it. Ooh, no sticks. That's a first down and a great catch, too. Did you see how he looked that one in? Lot of throws down on him. He can get the football. I'd sell a pass here, then I'd get it off to my half back. First and ten. Ball on the 22. The tar heel. Set up in the gun. On the ground with the tailback. Jim the tackle. Brought down. Looks to have been shaken up a bit on that play. Well, it doesn't look like it's too serious, guys, but you never know. Sometimes those small injuries turn into season-ending ones. When you're in the red zone, it's harder to spread out the defense because there's not a lot of room. But depending on the play, you can find some holes in the deep. North Carolina lines up with three receivers. Back to pass. Watch the throw. It's dropped. Oh, he could have had a big reception. Just let that one get away from his vision just for a split second. You got to go out there and compete. Be a competitor. It's third down and seven to go. Ball 19. North Carolina comes out of the shotgun. Looking. Steps up. He's looking down the middle. Oh, he has a pick and he dropped it. It's a good defense right there, though. It was hurt, but you know what? It's all the action. Anytime you're out there on defense and the pass is within arm's length away, you knock it down. Number 10 lines up for the field goal. He gets it up. And it's through the upright. That's four leads us to our Pontiac drive somewhere. North Carolina is ready to kick it away. Number 13 and number three back to return. Here's the kick. Number three feels it in the end zone. Not a very good series for this offense in their last run. They were just looking out to go and look at it. That's the thing. It's going to be the gap there and show the tomato. Somebody give me a helmet quickly. One man back for you. They'll throw on first down across the middle. It falls incomplete, and he overthrew his wide receiver. I don't know too many seven-foot guys play football, so maybe he should aim lower the next time. Second and ten, ball on the corner. The wing back, line up with three wide. He drops back with the throw. And it's incomplete. It's third down and 10. Ball on the 20 yard line. Three wide out here. Right back to pass. Over the middle. No. With a take down, they have the ball right there. I think mean, ball control is important for track. The three and out is what you want to avoid for sure. And line up the front this whole way. He gets it away. 
Number 25, they keep the 32. At the 40, inside the 30, to the 10. Goodbye. And the blink of an eye, he was gone. Brad, this kid is special. He just proved once again that he can make the big time play. You think I want you to go for two years? <laughs> no way. And he tacks on the extra point. So with just over two minutes left in the second quarter, our score, North Carolina, 24. North Carolina State, nothing. Number 10, ready to kick. And he got all of this one. Great hit. Number three, feels it in the end zone. The offense gets ready to start a new drive. Couldn't get anything. Last possession was a point in the end. They'll get the ball here at the 21. The offense is doing everything they can just to call the plays, and right now, they're not having much luck at all. Bottle the ball, and who's got it? One of the defensive linemen. And this turnover is certainly not what they were hoping for. The rich get richer, but let's not write them off just yet. It's their money. They can't have to run and throw the ball over and let this thing get out of hand. I threw a little play action pass here. Excellent field position to start the drive. The Tar Heel come out of the two tight end set. Nice play fake across the middle. They'll bring him down. And guys, he's already over 200 yards passing in the first half. So he's off to a great start. It'll be interesting to see if he can maintain this level of play for the rest of the game. North Carolina lines up in a bunch of formation. Couldn't haul it in. Dropped by the line. You just got to remember one thing. No turtle. It's third down at five to go. One with the 17-yard line. North Carolina lines up with three receivers. And he's a little yard on this one. He got nothing on that. Defense is really digging it down, you guys. They'll line it up for the field goal. The kick is up. And it's Flexi Uprights. Here's the Pontiac Drive Subway, bringing you fuel for the soul. North Carolina lines up for the kickoff. Number 15 and number three needs to return. He kicks it off, and he got all of that. Number three, feels it in the end zone. And the defense did a nice job of shutting down this offense the last time they got the ball. The offense is not picking it off to see if they're back in the same game. On the gun. Makes a move. And he's tackled. North Carolina State takes a timeout. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 21 yard line. The wolf pack. Come out the shotgun. Back to pass. Books. He wants the long ball. And he's got it. And they tackle him. Wow. Nice catch. Way to look at it. And the job by the wide receiver. These guys are moving the ball down the field. First and ten. Ball on the 45. Well, we'll that. Line up with three wide. Setting up the play action. Across the middle. He steps off. And down he goes. Way to look at him. Makes a kick. Sure was. He just played some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. It's first and ten. Ball on the 46. 
as they have three receivers but He's looking. Passes off the would-be tackler. Tipped away. The pass was knocked down. This defense is very aggressive, and they swarm to the football. They're always making plays to disrupt the passing game. Right. It's second down and 10 to go. And this is the fifth play of the first drive. And this impact linebacker is fired up down there. Play action. He's got hit as he threw. And that one is falling incomplete. With that pressure, he just couldn't do much with it. This chance of back is going to have to be the second. Good job. Third down and 10 coming up. And this is the sixth play of the drive. One man back field. Drop back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. He passes it. Complete. Nothing gained on the floor. They're going to try a long field goal here. He gets it up. And it's wide left. No good. I'd run it down the floor here. Nothing. Nothing. They'll take over at the 26. High formation here. They'll bring him down. A good six yards there by the fullback. Judge your kids that this is where they earn their strikes. Second and four. Ball on the 32 yard line. North Carolina comes out of the shotgun. Looking. Throws it to the outside. It's deflected. And he's brought down. That was a big time play and a new set of down. I think the defense might have been picking one thing. Well, I don't blame him. It's pretty common to see a run on third and second down, but this offense is keeping them captured. I just let the players go out there and have some fun here. It's first and ten, ball on the 38. North Carolina sets up in the eye. They'll throw on first down. Across the middle. Excellent open field tackle. Nice decision by the quarterback. Not only was it good decision making, but the offensive line protected just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, it'll be a first down nine out of ten times. They'll throw on first down, and he can't hang on to it. This incompletion is credited to the wide end. And so lucky. That's on second and ten. This is a big play of the drive. North Carolina State with six DBs on the field to counter this five receiver look. They connect again. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result is the first down. This is where you just go with what you know the best. North Carolina calls the timeout. You better kick it here. Right. Number 10, line up for the field goal. This will be a chip shot. The kick is up, and he got it. So here's the body act drive somewhere to recap what just happened. Number 10, looks ready to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. Number 3, gives it in the end zone. On the ground, up the middle. Got some open field at the point. Huge tackle as time expired. one half of play. This one is not even close. Our score, North Carolina 30, North Carolina State nothing. North Carolina State got the ball to start the game, so they'll be kicking off to start the second half. He kicks it. Number nine, fields it at the two. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. As a coach, you've got to be concerned with what the defense is doing. At. I tell my quarterback to take what the defense is giving you. They line up with an eye. They'll throw on first down. 
He rolls out to the right, and it's caught. And he's tackled. Three, maybe four yards on the back. The key here is making sure the offensive line gives the quarterback plenty of time to find the open receiver. They'll bring in their dive back. Across the middle, someone got a hand on it. The defense needed that one. About to move here by this quarterback. Great play that time, getting a hand on the football. It's third down and six to go. Ball on their own 22. Going with the shotgun here. He drops back. Look, rolls to the left. Across the middle. It's hit. There's an athletic play by the linebacker. Listen up, my friends. Nowadays, linebackers need to be able to do more than just stop the run. We got to be able to fly all around the field to play the pass, too. Number 45, hunts it, and it's a good one. Number three, here's the penalty. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out of the field for their next possession. They'll set up shot at the 29 yard line. North Carolina State comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Sheds that one, and down he goes. The handman gets the call and picks up five. Second and five coming up here. Ball on 34. North Carolina State lines up in a bunch formation. Jeffy moves there. A two-yard run by the handman. We're getting third and three here. Ball on the 36-yard line. They come out of nickel. Now look for the first and third and short. And they make the stop. And we got them up for the first down there. Yep, nice goal to run the ball there on third down. I like it. It's first and ten. All on the 43-yard line. Come on, showing three wide. He steps up, throws it to the outside. Got it, ball. I'll tell you what, Kurt, if that receiver doesn't get more aggressive, this defense is going to be knocking the ball down all game long. You're absolutely right. That was a heads up play by the corner, but it would have never happened if the receiver would have come back to the ball instead of waiting for it to fall into his lap. Defense running him down. They'll drop it for a loss. Passing situation here on third and long, and this is the sixth play of the drive. The Wolfpack come out of the ace formation. Back to back. Once and all, going deep. Incomplete. He just put a little too much air on the back. That's one of the reasons the defense is like to blitz, not only to sack the quarterback, but also to force him into making bad throws. Right. And I have to put this one away. He punts it. Number 25, fields it to 30. And now we'll see the offense come out of the field for their next possession. In this situation, you got to trust the quarterback's decision making. They'll get the ball here at the 38 yard line. North Carolina comes out with an eye formation. There's the play fake. Across the middle, got it to the senior. Good pickup by the receiver. Yeah, this kid loves the play. He wants the ball every time they throw it in. I'd run it down the throat here. Nothing too special. Second and one coming up here. Ball on the 47. The Tar here. Go with the eye formation. There's a missed tackle. And he's taken down. And he carried that one for a few yards. You know, when you have a guy that can grab five yards or so consistently, it sure takes some of the pressure off the passing game. The top of here. Come out of the ace formation. They'll throw on first down. Someone got a hand on it. And the safety got a hand on it that time. I like this one here. We got the defense thinking option. 
Did he hit it with a ten? Second and ten. Ball right around midfield. North Carolina lines up with three receivers. And they got a throw off. You gotta execute in this long run to take. Take the snap. Swing it in there. Third down and twelve to go. Ball on their own 49. They come out with three wide receivers. Run back to pass. He rolls left. Going deep. It's down. And it falls incomplete. Good job there by the defense to get a hand on it. It must hurt. But when you're going out for a pass and the ball is in the air, you need to go after it and come down with it. You just can't watch the defender bat it down. It's a high kick, and it holds up there. Number three, signals for a fair catch. He hauls it in at the 10. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll take over at the 10-yard line. North Carolina State lines up for the shotgun set with a quick throw. And that one's fallen incomplete. And he overthrew his wide receivers. I don't know too many seven-foot guys play football, so maybe he should aim lower the next time. Second and ten. Ball on their own ten. They line up in a double tight set. Here's the kid. And he can work yards on this one. And the linebacker comes up and makes a big stop. This is textbook. This is how you're supposed to play against the run. Yeah, and that time the defense got to go backwards. North Carolina State comes to the line with three wide. He runs back, steps up, and he's going to be sacked. How about that blitz, guys? Well, this is the play they like to call sometimes in this situation. The corner blitz. Here, the offense did do a very good job of picking it up. And you're right, folks. It's hard to tell sometimes where that pressure is coming from. Right. Already made him play with a puppet turn earlier. Number 26, punts it, and it's a good one. Number 25, yields at the 50. Well, before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. As a coach, you've got to be concerned with what the defense is going at. I tell my quarterback to take what the defense has given you. North Carolina comes out with three receivers bunch. Down the middle. And down he goes. Way to look it in. Nice kick. Sure was. He just played some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. This is what power football is all about. You've got to be able to run between the tackles. First and ten. Ball of the 23. The Tar Heel. Come on, show three wide. And he's tackled. He barely got it past the line of scrimmage that time. One yard. I run it off tackle here. Nothing too fancy. Just establish a solid rushing game. High formation here. They hit it off the bed. He's in. They'll bring him down. The offensive line got a really good push there. Line in the back to pick up nine of the four. you got to go out there and compete. Be a competitor. Have a look at our Old Spice Red Zone number. Red Zone, when performance matters the most. Heading to the fourth quarter. This one is well in hand. With the score, North Carolina 30, North Carolina State nothing. You only got a few yards to go for the first, so you just need to right the ball in there. Third down and short. Ball in the 13. The kicker got them points on their last red zone visit. Let's see if the offense can get points this time. Off his hands, incomplete. The pass was right there. Just couldn't be controlled. So just try and hit some more passes and practice. Right? So he saw the help he can get. They'll talk to the field goal unit here. 
He gets it up. And it's Flexi upright. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac Drive somewhere. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. It's a deep downfield. Number three, feels it in the end zone. This defense did a good job on the last series. They could have been the best to go three plays in that one. They get out there on the top. A little juke. And he stopped behind the line. The defensive end came through to put him away. Nice job of utilizing his athletic ability to get in there and then make a sure tackle. Second and 13. Ball on the 17 yard line. And they come out with three wide receivers. Back to pass. He's going right. That close to being intercepted. They're really fortunate that wasn't intercepted. Not a very smart decision by the quarterback. He had no shot at completing. Yeah, but that's just better than a perfect shot at it. He just didn't catch it. Uh, come out of the ace formation. The throws down the middle. Oh, great man. Brock down with only one man to beat. That's how you can work the now, sweetheart. As soon as you can play, what the coach? Oh, yeah, this offensive coordinator must have seen something that he can really like. North Carolina State lines up in a double flank set. And throws it to the outside. Almost picked off. That could have been a big play for the defense. Even though he had a good shot at picking it off, it's still a heck of a play to force the incomplete pass. Defense lines up with eight men in the box. Can't wrap him up. Tackle. A gain of three yards by the fullback. So another third down of Kelly for the offense. North Carolina State comes to the line with one man in the backfield. He drops back. He's looking. Throws to the middle. And he can't make the catch. Dropped by the wide end. They line up to put this one away. Number 26, punts it, and it's a good one. Number 25, fields it at the 11. Goes away from one. The defense was able to keep them out of the end zone on their last possession, but the offense did pick up three. I threw a little three action catch here. They'll start this drive at the 14-yard line. North Carolina comes to the line with three wide. Gets the ball. No, they fake it. Over the middle. And down he goes. Kirk, what do you have for us? Next catch put the receiver over 100 yards. He's been one of the quarterback's favorite targets all game long. As a quarterback, you've got to be aware of what the defense is throwing at you. It's first and 10. Ball on the 29-yard line. Number 18 has five receivers lined up here. Looking, throws it to the outside. And they make the stop. Nice decision by the quarterback. Not only was it good decision making, but the offensive line protected just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, it'll be a first down nine out of ten times. The Tar Heels come to the line with their jump hole package on the ground, left side. Brought down. Five yard pickup for the tailback. What I would do here is to get the fullback the ball and just let him poof straight up. Number 25 wants the ball. We'll see if they give it to him. This tackle, and down he goes. Well, coach, you picked up a few yards on that one. Brent, stop running by this kid. I give it to the halfback and have him run between. Here you gotta milk that clock. The Tar Heels come out showing three wide, and they make the stop. The halfback runs for four yards. Judge 
remind the kids that this is where they earn their stripes. It's second down at six to go. Ball number 37. Number 18, back in the gun. They're on a counter. And he's taken down. And it looks like there's an injury down there on the field. Anytime you can convert these short yardage plays to stay on the field, you're setting the tempo of the game. North Carolina comes out with two receivers by so we got a few yards on that pair. You know what, guys? If you can continue to pick up small chunks of yards like that, you can really start to wear a defense down. In this situation, I'm telling my guys to hold on to the football and just stay in the foul. They line up in an eye. He'll get this ball again. He takes off a tackle. And he's tackled. And not too much there on that run. Not too much. But the key here is try to milk as much time as possible. Second and seven coming up here. This is the ninth play of this drive. Number 25 is feeling it, and he wants the football in his hands. The counter. Tackle. Short little game there, just trying to keep that clock running. Keep that clock running and keep that other offense off the field. The offense faces another third down as they line it up. High formation here. Back to pass. He's going left. He's hit and got away. Rock down. We got to get into the end zone here. And since we're in the red zone, let's have a look at the numbers brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters the most. High formation, looking for six. Go with a run once again. Touchdown, North Carolina. Well executed play there. Good blocking to take time. Just let it get the ball in. And he taps on the extra point. So with just over a minute to go here in the fourth quarter, four, North Carolina, 20, North Carolina State, nothing. North Carolina is ready to kick it away. Six at the Brave, he's in the end zone. They're just about ready to get this drive started for their last series. And it's a promise to end it. At the 20. They're going to give the backup quarterbacks the playing time as a blowout. The defense comes up with a good play to pull him down for a loss. Nice call by the defensive coordinator. It's like he's in their huddle sometimes. Second and ten, ball on the point. The Wolf Pack line up with three wide. He's going left. It's it. The corner made a good play on the ball. He sure did. This kid is very athletic. If he doesn't get a pick, he does his best to knock the ball down. North Carolina State goes with the ace set here. He drops back. Watch the throw outside. Find his receiver, and down he goes. Good job of attacking the coverage to keep the drive alive. That was a great look at pass to move the sticks on third down. Right. It's first and ten. Ball on the 40-yard line. The defense lines up with six DBs. With the throw. Finds the freshman. That last pass got him only a yard. Second and nine. This is the fifth play of this run. They come out with four linebackers. They'll give it off here. Get the tackle. And he's tackled. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. 
The defense will try to stop this third down as they were unsuccessful the first time on this drive. And the exact linebacker is turned up now. And he is thrilled with the loss on that one because he couldn't get past those big linemen. You got that right. They sacrificed their bodies in there and stuffed them. Well, this blowout will only add more fuel to the fire of this rivalry. We're going to have to wait till next year's meeting to settle their differences. Anyone who wants to watch this, North Carolina took away with Frank and Rice this year, and up here the fans in the stadium will play just as much as the players. They were the better team today and added another great chapter to this rivalry. For Lee Corso and Kirk Kirk Street, I'm Brad Nessler with our final goodbye. We'll catch you next time. Thank <laughs> you.